Welcome to Fairford, a community that thrives on the values of collaboration, sustainability and a shared vision of the future. I'm thrilled to announce that Cotswold District Council has formally adopted the Fairford Neighbourhood Development Plan, a roadmap that will shape the Fairford community's growth with a focus on sustainable development. The Fairford Neighbourhood Development Plan is a collective effort to guide our community's growth in a way that benefits everyone. It's our opportunity to shape our town's future and protect what makes Fairford unique. The Fairford Neighbourhood Plan is a culmination of 10 years work and consultation and a great moment for the Fairford community. The plan focuses on key areas that are important to us, preserving our historic landmarks, promoting sustainable development, and creating vibrant public spaces for residents to enjoy. With this plan in place, we are making sure that the future growth of our town is in line with the aspirations and needs of our residents. We hope that the Fairford plan will protect the riverside area, green spaces and the bee line along the river from Lake 104 to Quennington. It will also increase sewage capacity before new housing and direct future development to higher ground, which doesn't increase flood risk. We want to lead the way with sustainable development and we'll work closely with Cotswold District Council to transform these goals into reality. The Fairford Neighbourhood Development Plan is an innovative and forward-thinking plan and one that reflects Cotswold District Council's commitment to empowering residents and promoting sustainable growth. This wide-reaching plan protects valued local green spaces and provides important local direction on heritage, flooding and climate change. The plan sets a positive vision for the town and provides a unique opportunity for residents to actively contribute to shaping their area. For more information and to engage with the plan, please visit cotswold.gov.uk forward slash neighbourhood planning.